like a story, yes. comes onto the site in about 26 tiny tanks of like petrol tanks. Wow. We put it through a process we call autolysis, where we heat it, and this is what comes out at the end of the process. Now, this is a lot more liquid, and if you notice, you're starting to get it to, to settle out. What's happened is the food in the yeast, the um, materials in the yeast, it's all dissolved in the water, whereas the cell walls, they don't dissolve at all, they are starting to fall away from it. In order to get rid of the cell walls, we put it through a centrifuge. Now that withers the material around, and the cell walls are thrown out at the side where the liquor stream carries on, and we finish up with this, and this is the liquor stream. This is called bright liquor. Also, we need to watch the cell walls to make sure we get every little bit of the um, potion and so on off them, and when we do that, the water goes in there, and that's very, very dilute. No use at all for my mind, so I hope you'll agree. So, we take this and put it through an evaporator. Now, when you walk into school, on a rainy day, you'll find the road very dark colored. If you go and have some wonderful lessons, for example, with Mrs. Meeks or someone like that, tremendous lessons, and then at lunchtime, you go outside and the whole place is dry. The water is evaporated just in the time you've been having your lesson. That's what happens here. We accelerate that, we drive up some of the water, and finish up now with, look at this, this is much thicker. This is more like engine oil or something like that, as opposed to this one. So you can see the difference there. Now, up to that point, we polish this a little bit more, so it's even smoother, and the way we do that is we actually force all of it. Now think about this, everything that's going to become marmite is actually forced through a really, really thick cloth. And this is some of the cloth, now you look at this. Wow, that's thick. That's the cloth. Yeah, it's thicker than jeans. Exactly, it really is, it's amazingly thick cloth. That must be just really hard through there. Yeah. I can't imagine anything getting through there. We, we have to, thick to it, have to push up the, push up the pressure just to get it through there. And once that comes through, is that a marmite going through there? Ah, once it comes through there, there's but you see, we understand we got it's come through there like that. And so there's still a bit of water left. We put it into another evaporator, and all the solid material that's in there gets more and more concentrated. So the volume goes down, the solid, the solid goes, and eventually. <laughs>